guys and welcome to another episode of Shavana Social. I am in Beach Bay, Bottom Town. I randomly just chose a spot to stop by today and have a little chat with you guys. And this is not a regular schmegular story time like I would normally do. Now I'm at a really cool spot which is said to be a turtle nesting area so there should be no driving here so they blocked off the entrance and um, let's see what this is about Like the beach is just so relaxing. I'm not looking at the bottom part here, but I'm gonna try to see if we can go all the way up there and have our convo. Like how do oh they swim over that side? That was just a dumb question. Alright, so I guess I could do <sighs> my story time. Yeah. Okay, so I am back. Alright, so story time. It is an awkward one because right, the lighting is better this way. Alright, so I don't know why I just thought to share it, but I was having a conversation. I hope you can hear me. I was having a conversation this morning with my mother about my siblings and it dawned on me that my brother is literally provoking. Like brothers were born to just provoke their little ones, their little sisters, their little siblings. So this is kind of an embarrassing story but let's dive right into it. So in high school I was a good girl. Um, but I had a boyfriend in high school. You guys can guess where the story is going. And we decided to go to second base. <sighs> oh my gosh. So we ended up going to the beach. Nice setting and all. And stuff happens. So after everything now, Reach back on the road, saw my brother at the shop on our lane, and we create this bug of excitement. And eventually, people can figure out what happens. So everybody on the lane knew what happened that day, knew that Shabana was the innocent again. Oh my gosh! So when I got home, brother called my mother, called one my, my big sister, and everybody on the phone. So my, two, my big sister was there, my oldest sister was on the phone, my mother was on the phone. He started telling everything. So I admit, I admit what went on. And my mother started crying. It's like this a whole excitement over this one thing. It, the, it was so embarrassing because I got my mother crying. And everybody looked for me like I disappoint them. And then the following week, I had to take a test to ensure that I'm okay like 
my family i never thought on of them to be like super overprotective but you know my siblings grew me a bit so they want the best and everything but that's i just don't i don't know why i had to share the story but my brothers are hell they were sent from hell and mommy's sweet mommy was like oh well you know you're gonna be addicted now and you shouldn't be so young you should have wait until you're adult or you know you can when things happen you can take care of yourself so <laughs> that's the embarrassing story sun hot i thought i wanted to share i guess you guys can share with me your embarrassing stories was it embarrassing like my bit of story that i shared let me know and don't forget to like this video afterwards comment below share my content and subscribe tell your friend your brother your sister your uncle anybody to subscribe thank you so much for another episode of shabana social this is a short video but i hope you enjoyed a little bit of story if you have any embarrassing stories about your brothers you know them embarrassed i have so much more but i was having a conversation with my mother and um it was like you know your brother really love you and all, all of that and that just came to mind him love me so till it embarrassed me <laughs> all right let me know guys take care have a wonderful rest of your sunday love peace respect bye gone.